We're talking today about this bishop, Bishop Zarek, who was the cause of why Father Frank Pavone was taken and dismissed out of the priesthood. His priesthood was taken away. They say the Vatican was behind it too, but the main person is this bishop, who even back in 2017 was trying to get Father Frank Pavone out of the priesthood, dismissed. Now this bishop is the cause and the reason of why Father Frank Pavone has been dismissed from the priesthood. I want you to listen to what Father Frank Pavone says in his own words about this bishop from Amarillo, Texas, who's caused him such horrible trouble since 2017. They just want to find some excuse. Throw Father Frank out of the priesthood. I'll tell you a story. The Bishop of Amarillo, some of you were asking, well, who is this bishop that's been causing so much problem for you? Um, the, the Bishop of, of Amarillo, Texas. He's, this, he's in his final year there anyway as bishop, but uh, Zurich is his name. And he called me into a meeting five years ago. He was, you know, complaining about my work like he always does. And he said, um, he said, well, you know, you, you, I don't want you doing this, uh, doing this work. And I said, well, you want me in the diocese? You want me to do, you know, you want to give me an assignment in the diocese? Is there any benefit to me being in the diocese? And he said, no. So he didn't want me doing work in the diocese, and he didn't want to let me do work outside the diocese. And I knew this already. So I said, well, you want me out of the priesthood, don't you? Now, there were other witnesses in this meeting, and I can tell you who they are, too. And they know, and they remember this. And he said, never, never, twice, out loud. Never, never. I would never want you out of the priesthood. This is my bishop talking to me. Never, never. Remember that, bishop? I'm sure he'll see this video. Never, never. This is in 2017. A few weeks later, after that meeting, I get a letter from him saying, I want you to request to be dismissed from the priesthood. And if you don't request it, I'm going to request the Vatican to dismiss you from the priesthood. I, I wrote about This is all on that website, frfrankpavone.com. This is not, th listen, I have no secrets. This is all out in the open. You can read about it. I know, what, <laughs> listen, you're with me here because you don't need you know, the vast majority of you, you don't need any explanation. I, I, you know, you don't need me to explain anything. You're with me all the way, and I appreciate that. But for those that, that you know, that, that want to understand this and uh, get some of the background, the guy says in the meeting with witnesses there, I would never want you out of the priesthood. And a few weeks later, he sends me a letter demanding that I leave the priesthood. I'm never going to leave the priesthood. Now, they can send all kind of letters that they, that they want, but ink on a piece of paper doesn't change what's in the heart, does it? I'm clear about what, I, what I'm committed to. Words on a piece of paper, even if they come from that building there, they, they, don't, they don't change what's in here. I've never had a single moment of doubt about my vocation as a priest. I've never had a single moment of doubt about my vocation as a pro-life leader. This is not going to change. You are so good in supporting me because I get this nonsense from some of these guys. But what, I hear, what do I hear from you? What do I hear from you when I am out on the road giving my pro-life talks, praying with you in front of abortion facilities, teaching the word of God when it comes to abortion, praying with you as I'm going to do now. I, I stay up with me a little bit longer and we'll say some prayers together because that's, that's what this is all about. What do you tell me? Keep it up, Father. Keep it up. So according to Father Pavone, Bishop Patrick Zurich is the one who was causing him to cause him trouble in 2017. He tried to get him dismissed out of the priesthood. Poor Father Pavone. This bishop has just been antagonizing and going after Father Pavone since 2017, trying to get him out. And he's this bishop 
is the one behind why Father Pavone has been dismissed out of the priesthood. And it all has to deal with because poor Father Pavone is trying to get the word out about abortion being evil, and they don't want him to speak out so loud.